Welcome back to How to Make You a Better Public Speaker. Today is Lesson 48, and we are giving away an award. That is right. This is your moment to get on stage and be a presenter and give someone their oh-so-deserving de reward. And here are three ways to help you maximize your opportunity on stage. Number one, having effective time management. Award ceremonies are typically under a time-sensitive agenda and each presenter has to be able to get up there say what they're going to say give their award and even the person receiving the speech by the way foreshadowing that might be another video but you as a presenter have a certain amount of time so you need to maximize it with a pretty good structure right so time management effective number two language precision now depending on what this person is getting an award for you know, if you're a doctor Having precise doctor jargon and doctor jokes is going to be crucial for your audience, who are probably also doctors, to understand and un, you know make make a good connection. Also, with a short amount of time, if you can use the right language, it's going to be effective to get your message across and show what that person has done and why it's so meaningful. Because you might have thirty seconds to a minute, so being precise with your language. It's going to be key. Number three, we have storytelling, more or less effective storyteller. Again, with the 30 seconds to one minute to two minutes, you need to be able to have a beginning, middle, and end, a good anecdote, maybe a little joke, something that is going to be powerful and memorable. Because again, you might be giving a lifetime achievement award. You're going to encompass something in a short amount of time you better make it powerful and make it organized and make it easy for the audience to follow. All right, so let's recap. Effective time management, language precision, and becoming an effective storyteller. You master these three points, you're going to be able to give an award away and the presenter will be so thankful. People might actually forget who got the award. Remember your speech. So see you next time on how to make you a better public speaker.